always been a home away from home for us, and when we first started touring, we were fucking 10 years younger. We came up to Canada for the first time, and we played a fucking Sneaky D's. I don't know where I am, but this place I've never been here, but make some noise for it and all the fucking staff here helping us out. Put your hands in Obviously, the world has been affected very highly all across the board. But what a lot of people don't realize is this industry, it was the first industry to go, and it's slowly becoming the last one to come back. We all know people that have lost their jobs, family members that lost lives, family, whatever, you know? This problem that we have not been up here for two and a half years is very small, but it is our problem. And for a long time, I felt like I lost my sense of fucking purpose. I'd be lying to you if I didn't get up here and tell you that. A lot of people feel the same way. So the fact that we're in this fucking room, I'm looking out at all of you, we're doing this again, means a fucking lot to us. So. Thank you. Thank you.
that we're so grateful to be given this lane and this opportunity by such an influential man that we get to share this stage with. Let's make some fucking noise for our headliners tonight. Let's hear it from all We're gonna play only one for you. 